pretty intense, I can tell you that much. Raging rivers of Ruidoso, New Mexico. But there's one problem. These aren't rivers, they're village streets. The culprit, wildfire burn scars. We're experiencing some heavy flooding, uh, obviously off the burn scars, and we have so many now that there's so many different ways uh, that this can come at us. In the most simple terms, the top layer of mountains are held together by trees and bushes. When wildfires scorch that foundation, one big storm can bring it all crumbling down. Burned soil can be as water repellent as pavement, and that leads to a flash flooding free for all. That soil would absorb a bunch of water when it rains, and some of that seeps in underground. But when that ground has been burned, especially when it's burned really hot, that doesn't happen anymore. Even worse, burn scars can create thunderstorms. Australian scientists found that burnt black soil can actually increase the heat rising up hillsides. And that extra quick rising heat triggers thunderstorms, increasing rainfall rates above an already dangerous landscape. The area that maybe it would take an inch of rain in an hour to flood under normal conditions, now you're getting flooding from like a quarter inch in 20 minutes. And once water starts thundering down the mountainside, there's no stopping it. These huge, huge rocks, huge boulders, tree trunks, all of these things can come downstream. And, and it happens very quickly. The flood channels are widening. Uh, our culverts have been blown out. We've, had, we've got streets closed all over town. We've got parts of the community that is just literally unsafe because now we have uh, landslides or mudslides. Fires, then floods changing the course of lives. It's really very stressful. You know, we lost over 500 homes in the village limits itself. That's not counting the county to fire. And now then we've lost over 125 to the flood. 